Hey everyone, Jeremy here. Welcome, welcome to the channel. Before I get into the Echo trailer, please remember to hit that like and subscribe. It is a very small gesture that has a very big impact on the channel. So I appreciate it each time you do. All right, Echo, this is kind of weird. This trailer dropped on a Friday. I feel like that's kind of random. Uh, I, trailers usually drop at the beginning of a week and that is intentional for marketing purposes because then you have people talking about the trailer throughout their work week or school week, whatever it may be, because when you drop something on a Friday, typically that means you have the weekend to forget about it. You might talk to your friends about it a little bit over the weekend, but it's not a priority then. But during the work week, it becomes, you know, it, it's water cooler talk. Very strange you're dropping it on a Friday, which as a person who's not been excited for this series, I don't feel like that's necessarily a good sign. It could be really good. I, I'm always a person who will give something a fair shot. If you watch this channel at all, I try to stay positive. I want everything to be good. But it is very strange to me that they're dropping it on a, the trailer on a Friday. And this is going to be one of the first, if not the first, Disney show, probably not the first, but Marvel show at least, to drop all the episodes at once. So I have so many questions about this. Um, yeah, let's just do this. <laughs> Okay, I, Fisk. I see everything that you are. I always have. Oh! Oh! got my interest. You have so much pain in you. 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 So much rage. That you can't contain it. think that was a good trailer um I, I i say that questioningly that was a good trailer no it was a really good trailer I, i'm gonna admit that is a solid trailer i was really into that trailer actually um the action looked good i love a good street level i mean i love dd daredevil was so good and punisher punisher had my heart the whole time i freaking love that series punisher being a massive character i loved growing up so with this, it, it evokes quite a bit of that. You've got a character that's pretty much a street level character that has no powers, that is trying to, we're gonna assume, do good. Uh, <laughs> but I don't know. Like, I, I was won over by the Fisk stuff and I liked the action that we saw, but there's still something that is nagging at me. Like, a bunch of images can always look, look great. Think of the Transformers movies. Even the worst Transformers movie had a fantastic trailer. So trailers can be very misleading on quality. And not even Transformers. I don't even have to bag on Transformers. Just think of a movie where you saw a really great trailer and went to the movie thinking you're going to see an awesome film. And it turned out to be dog poop. This is a great trailer. This was such a solid trailer. I'm just still not convinced about the show. 
I'm, or I'm, I'm really not convinced about her as a lead character. Echo to me, I, I don't know the character very well from the comics, but when I did know her, the, the stories I have read with her, she really felt like a solid secondary character, not a lead. And that is 100% the way I felt after Hawkeye. Her character didn't really stand out to me. And it always was a question for me on why are they giving her a series. It, it is one of the fundamental problems I think Marvel has made for themselves over the years is they keep trying to spin off every single side character into their own series or movie and that's not necessary i know i know they've done it in the comics the comics get away with that because they aren't spending millions upon millions of dollars just for one character you can do a 10 run comic and not spend that kind of money that's not the case for the mcu that's why I still kind of look at this series going, but will I really care? Will will I get hooked or attached to this character like I have the best of the MCU characters? They, they, they've got a ways to go to show that there's a reason for me to get attached to her and they've not given it to me yet. And this trailer, this trailer really doesn't do it. It got me attached to Wilson. It got me it got me interested in her relationship with Fisk, but it didn't get me interested in her. And it's not saying it's gonna be a bad series. I'm just still a person who has questions. I, I, I want it to be good. I want every freaking series to be good. I, I don't wanna ever waste my time watching a series that isn't good. I just, I just don't know. I don't know, but I'm gonna give it a shot. Um, what did you think? Leave your comments below. Are you excited for this? Uh, I know there are Echo fans out there. Maybe you're one of them and you have thoughts on this trailer. I did recognize the whole Wilson not having his eye thing. And yeah, I, I know that story. Maybe this swayed you and now you're more excited or less excited. I don't know. Whatever your thoughts, leave them in the comments below. Like I mentioned up top, remember to hit that like and subscribe. And before I go, as always, Please take care of yourselves and please take care of each other. Thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.